Marcos Alonso. Oh, Marcos Alonso. Guys, I told you Alonso was gonna score today. It's happened. You have to believe in me. You have to trust me. Ha ha ha. Anyways, guys, all the jokes aside, we won. Three point in the pocket. Clean sheet. Very professional kind of a performance. Thomas Tuchel, first win at Chelsea Football Club. Clean sheet. Can you really complain about it? I don't think so. Please watch my vlog. Guys, it's Oggs from the US. Welcome to the channel and thank you for watching another episode of Sofa Vlog. Sofa Vlog from the US. But I'm taking you live from Stamford Bridge where Chelsea Football Club are gonna play against Burnley. Burnley are flying high. They are high on confidence now because they've been winning games. And Chelsea, we are not so confident right now. New manager, we drew the, the first game under him and the second game is going to be a completely different kind of ball game. This game, we need to, to win. It's a must win game. If we're gonna pretend getting to top four this is the game that we can't afford to drop point so let's see what thomas is going to do today hopefully it's gonna be a very happy game for chelsea football club the lineup just came out and it's very surprising mendy aspiliqueta rudiger tiago silva Kalium Hasunadoi, Kovacic, Jorginho, Alonso, Manson Mount, Timo Werner, Tammy Abraham, Sabs, Kepa, Christensen, Kante, Pulisic, Zuma, Giroud, Chilwell, James, and Harvard. Oh my goodness. Marcos Alonso, Rudiger, Jorginho. Very questionable indeed. But it's Thomas Tuchel, it's the honeymoon period, so let's wait and see what's going to happen. If he was the other guy, he was going to be called all kind of names, freestyling, why this and that, why Rudiger is playing, no Marcos Alonso on my team, get out my club, blah, blah, blah. But for Thomas Tuchel, he's very brave, you know, haha, <laughs> he's bold. I love the bold decisions. I love the, the, the lineup and everything. It's always start like this. I hope we can continue to support the manager even during hard time. I'm gonna support him. I think it's a good enough team to win uh, this game because he sees those players every single day in training. He's been training with them for four days. I think he knows what he's trying to do. The first half, I was surprised by Burnley's uh, game approach. It was uh, strange because usually they're going to sit back and wait. But they took the game to us. They didn't really sit back, to be honest with you. They were creating some chances here and there. And Chelsea had possession, of course, because that's what we do. Possession, possession with no final result. But I was really surprised by Burley and Chelsea. We had few chances. I can say a few lazy chances here and there for the first 30 minutes. You know, some crosses that didn't really bring anything. Some some lazy shot from uh, Timo Verna, uh, Kovacic, a header from Marcos Alonso, and Tammy Abraham fighting with. Uh, uh, with Mason Mount for the ball, Callum Hassan Aldoy lazy passes in the box. It wasn't really connecting that good in the final third as usual. Uh, let's talk a little bit about Timo Werner. Oh my gosh. I hope that the end is going to be better. But this guy is lacking in confidence. Did you see the shot that he was taking? Did you see how his body language was every time that he lost the ball in the box or something my goodness he can't even connect a proper shot i don't know what's going on with timo verna 
it could come back and bite me at the backside but i'm start worrying a little bit about timo verna man mason mount shot also a very awful very poor um edward mendy distribution also a little bit shaky overall is a chelsea thing in the first 35 minutes let's see if we can score a goal before half time so we can be even more confident in the second half 40 minutes finally the first goal for thomas tusho the first goal for caesar aspiliqueta and what a counter it started by Jorginho. Jorginho to Mason Mount, Mason Mount quickly to Kalim Hasnadoy, Kalim Hasnadoy to Aspiliqueta who scored a wonderful goal because our attacker can't even score a goal. It took Aspiliqueta of all people to come to the rescue. So first half 1-0 Chelsea Football Club is a perfect result so Thomas Tuchel can make some adjustment and see the game out in the second half. The second half. My goodness, I feel like a genius now because I predicted that Marco Alonso was going to score. What a goal from Marco Alonso and kind of sent a message to Frank Lampard by pointing the badge and doing all the craziness. But it is what it is, man. He's enjoying his life now as a, a wing back and what a goal that is a pure striker kind of goal the goal that uh, timo verna can only dream of and talking about timo verna my goodness this guy need our prayers i'm serious right now if you are a pastor imam or whatever you believe in let's just get together and pray for timo verna it's getting worse and worse people been blaming all kind of stuff you know the positioning da -da 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 -da, such and such we don't play to his strength we're not giving him balls all kind of excuses i'm tired of excuses this guy needs to start performing and we need to play we need to play we need to pray for him anyways guys it was a very controlled game in general burnley didn't have a shot on target correct me if i'm wrong they had some dangerous situations here and there but we dealt with the situations very very good so you have to congratulate the defense as a unit and uh, team uh team of Verna again and uh tiago silva was immense uh the hustle himself rudiger was also very good he's Pass range is very good and I think this is the reason why Tusho is going to prefer him uh, over somebody like uh, Kurt Zuma. But hey, all I wanted to see from this game is a win because we can't drop point anymore. Okay, we have to keep fighting for any point that we can get. So Thomas Tusho first win, three point in the pocket, clean sheet. Kalium Hasunadoy, man of the match, one more time. I don't know how many games now he's been like man of the match and man of the match, man of the match. This guy is awesome. And I am also happy that uh, he was taken off so he can save some energy for Spurs. Rhys James came on also. And um, it was good to see those tactical changes, something that you didn't expect. You know, out of the blue, you surprise everybody, you get the result, and you move. Anyways, I can't really complain. I'm going to take three points, clean shit, put in my pocket, and run. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe. If you really like the video, make sure you subscribe. And turn on your notification. And turn on your notification. For more videos, click here. And to subscribe, click here. What are you waiting for? Subscribe now. Uh, I can't find you.